Hello, welcome back to Blender Station Live. In this episode, I want to show you something interesting. It's basically kind of like a still experimental, but yeah, I'm using Blender uh, VSE, Video Sequence Editor. So basically, um, I'm testing out kind of like an idea to be able to convert one language into another language easily. And I'm using Blender and AI. I'm actually, um, this is an add-on uh, for Blender that's basically importing subtitle, right? Um, but what I want to show you is that, um, okay, this is the add-on. It's called sub-import. It doesn't automatically translate uh, the language, but if you have like a video from YouTube or any video that you record with another language and you want to convert it into English, or yeah, in this case, I'm just thinking like, we are like English speaking person or English speaking user and we want to translate any language into English, we can do it using um, AI. Yeah, I'm using this open AI whisper. I just found out about this like last night on Twitter and I thought, okay, this is kind of interesting. Uh, let's see how good this actually is. So you can have a video in any language that's not English or even in English and it's gonna try to transcribe the video for you okay with the time code and everything so in order to to use this I'm using Mac right M1 iMac all we need to do is just to type this on the terminal so with a pip install with the git and this address we're gonna install this whisper module uh, and we can actually run this on using I you can run this using Python code or we can run it as a command on terminal okay so it sounds might be a little bit technical but it's actually really easy to use surprisingly so the command lines to use this API is just like whisper what's your ad audio it can be in wave format or any other audio format and then just specify the, the model the language can be any language. Uh, you can specify the language, or it's, or it's gonna be smart enough to translate for translate it for you. Anyway, it's gonna the output is gonna be SRT. So I'm just gonna show you the demonstration. Anyway, this is one of the result. Okay, it's a. Uh, I just imagine like if you are like a YouTuber and you want to speak in uh, a different language, or you want to give it to another user with different uh with different language to you you can easily translate that okay okay i recorded something earlier using apple clips okay the apple clips itself actually have like a live text um feature so if you speak in different language it's gonna convert it into that language into a text okay this is like a feature of apple clips um what I'll do, this is the whole step. Uh, I will show it to you. File, export as audio only. And I just gonna save it on the file. I'm just gonna save it on the desktop for now. And from the desktop, we're gonna get the file. Okay, it's, it's M4A audio format. I'm gonna drop it into my raw audio folder. So I've done a couple. This is uh, yeah, the text that's transcribed from that, from this video, actually. This video is using um, Bahasa, right? So, but I'm gonna transcribe it first and then convert it into English. So I will open, oops, I will open the terminal with, oh well, okay. Show in and closing folder, okay. And I will do, I will create a new terminal on that fol folder and I will run whisper. So whisper. And what what's what was the clip name? 
Amazon. Okay. Whisper clips. Forty-five. Okay. So I just run this AI. Uh, Whisper AI, and it's gonna try to read into that audio. And it's detecting the language. It's called it's in, in Indonesian, Bahasa Indonesia, and it's gonna transcribe it into text. Okay, and it's gonna be text, SRT, and VTT. If I open up Sublime Text, wait, I'll show you. This is the text. So this is transcribe terms, and then this is VTT format. Um, good for web text video and this is for this is SRT can be for YouTube if you're a youtuber I assume you can be a youtuber and then you can have like video in any language you can use this um, open AI whisper and then transcribe it okay so if everything works okay I think it's still working and it's it's finished now we have a subtitle that we can load into Blender. It's in Indonesian language, but I can use the AI to convert it, to translate it. So, yeah, all we need to do is to run, rerun the commands. And this time we specify translate or something. Task translate language. We okay. In, in order to make this faster, I just say this language is Indonesian and just try the task to translate the language. Let's take a look at the SRT. Yeah, this is what I just said on in that in this video. We're gonna open this inside Blender. File, new. If you open Blender, you're gonna have 3D view, right? Uh, you can you can actually switch to video sequencer and then have it with the video preview, etc. But the faster the faster way is just to open up video editing layout. Okay. And I already have the add-on installed for the subtitle. It's called subs in import, right? And I already ins have it installed, so so I can actually just import my subtitle and the video. First of all, I will ins import the video. I'm gonna save this as demo subtitle. So we have video, and we're gonna have the translations in in English. First of all, I'm gonna shift a import the video from that folder oh okay not this one the other one uh, shift a movie downloads the video from today okay this this guy over here the color is weird because it's using HDR uh, but anyway this is With the stripe here, we have we can display the waveform, okay, and the video format. Of course, it's it's a vertical one. Let's just adjust that very quickly. So this video, we need to scale it. Okay, save. Now let's adjust the length. Just copy this frame number and then paste it into the end. Okay. Yeah. So this guy is speaking in Indonesian Bahasa, and we're gonna import SRT. So where is it? All right. We might already have something.
use language to specify I didn't yeah this is the translations and I believe that we have the translation over here huh, sorry this state manager thing is a little bit funny the first time you use it it's gonna be like okay yeah it's already translated into the subtitle so if we just import it into blender using this tool import SRT so hopefully this works I'm trying this what uh, let me check the I'm trying to reposition this text okay maybe I'm using the wrong subtitle import Two two nine. Where is it? Forty five. This one. Okay. Yeah. Okay. That's the uh, in the original language. How about the new one today, today? Let's delete this again using X tools import. This one. I don't know why it's appending the appending extra notes. Okay. It's transcribing the different clip, okay. I forgot. I have two video in this folder and it, it was transcribing the, the previous one. If we open this anyway with the uh, applications like IINA, and let's see turn off HDR we get subtitle let's scale the text yeah so I can like read the text you know Hello everyone, I'm trying this application called Whisper. Basically, you can change the sound of the language from one language to another, right? This is the transcript, trans, uh, transcription, translations from the original language. 
So using OpenAI Whisper, we have the subtitle. Okay, it's really cool actually. Yeah, all right. This one I'm using app called Ina. The clip here. Okay, let's okay. Let's try it. Okay, this now we we get the proper translations. Let get back to Blender. Select B box select X delete and then import subtitle this guy ah okay yeah so select this select the stripe select one of them select the stripe locations option hold options and then just drag it up okay hello semuanya hari ini kita akan mencoba fitur apple clips di mana kita akan menggunakan suatu bahasa But Let's yeah, translate it into another I language. Say. I will use this app called Whisper, and we will change the language from Indonesia to English. Okay, mari kita coba. Yeah. So that's so we successfully translate the the language and okay this guy. It's just the position of this stripe needs to be adjusted. Now you can just simply render out. Uh, the animations with the new language this is the original language from apple clips and we have the translated one so i think yeah that's how it works so basically yeah the, the blender add-on is called subs import it doesn't translate it the one that's doing the translation is the the ai so you go to github open ai whisper just install the module first using this setup you just need to run this in the terminal it's gonna grab the whisper it's gonna install the app for you so you have this app called whisper okay. whisper that will simply run you need to specify just the audio and within few seconds you're gonna get the transcription and then you can translate it as well into english language i believe it it can also translate to it's gonna it can do the reverse from english to other language but for now, yeah, I think that's pretty much what I want to show you. So, yeah, hopefully you find this useful. Um, thanks again for tuning in, and I'll see you next time. Thank you. Bye.